welcome back to another truck sim video. Yes, I'm gonna tow this old uh, chassis out. Tow the sassay. Chassay? Chassay. What? Tomato Chassay. sauce sassay? Yes, yeah, I'll like tow that. I'll have more of a brown sauce sassay. Uh, go on then, boy. Do you wanna steer it? Yeah, I'll get in and steer it. Send her on. Send her on, go on. Yeah. Yeah, I have it. It's like a mouse trap. Ah! There it is. Lift it. Oh, one through here. Oh. <laughs> Away we go. Look at that. Oh. What's going on? Sorry, Helen. Where is your cab? Where is my cab? In your garden. Oh. Watch me chassis! Stop, there you go. I'll let you know when I'm done. You want me to come and get it again? Yeah, unless you want to leave it here. No, that's an eyesore. Let's get some acid on the old girl. We'll soak her in acid first. We'll just let that do its job for a minute, pulling out all the dirt. We'll give it a good old steam off. The only reason I'm doing this is because obviously it's going into the unit and I want to get as much dirt off here before we put it in there. Just getting the radiator out dry. Oh yeah. Loosen the off, look. We'll see what happens. Dude. You just broke it. Yeah, I want a budget for this build. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Gotta fool me. <laughs> ah! I ain't cleaned very well under here. Oh, yeah. oh well, that's because I can't get to it. I'm trying to get it out, so... God's sake, you pair. Well, that acid's still in my eye. Well, you've got four eyes. <laughs> How do you not see well, it coming? It's got oh, in. Get out. Come on. Sean is loving the four series build episodes. <laughs> Brilliant. A lot of our customers say, well, can't you make that go? <laughs> no. There we go. Radiator out. What are we gonna do with that, Sean? Right in the skip. Do you want some pedals? Yeah, mate, you right. Can now clean all this in here. Yeah, Look at that. She's coming up a tree. Ah, uh, but you know better again. Slowly disappearing. It's slowly disappearing, it's getting better and better. Every time I look at it. Yeah. And Jubilee clips look new, doesn't it? There's a pair of thermostats in there, Tim. Is that what that is? Yeah, thermostat housing. Hey, so you do know your way around the 4 Series? Of course I do. Good man. I'm pleased to hear it. When you buy a new radio, what do you get? The radiator. You need to keep that bit. You want another intercooler probably and an air con rad. Right? They all just bolt together, but should mm. come with this bracket tree on here. Let's we'll have to see what it comes with. Well, you got all your pipe work. You need that pressure sensor for your air con. That's for your air con. Tell you what, go and put it down near my engine. And we'll come back to this at a later date. Can I break and slide off the end of the forks? No. There we go, I think I've got most of it off. There's obviously going to be more come off when I take things off like this. That I'll get, Everything's coming off. It's going to basically just be two rails with the cross members. And we got the radiator off while we was doing it as well, so I didn't want that in the unit. Yes, yeah, it's good to go to the unit. Oh! Oh! How does she handle? Very well, yeah! City prep, lads! Sydney 24. Yeah, mate, Scammel. Scammel's going to Sydney. Scammel, Sydney. The cab is sitting here, it's waiting to go to Darren's. Just got to get a trestle made up for it to sit on for transport. We can strip it out. All the dash, all the interior, basically going to be a shell. That sits here waiting to go see Darren. This four series is going to look. Blowtorch, really? No, Tim. Ready for the four series. What, are you going to burn it? Sorry. Not funny. Look at the floor, Helen. I know, it's beautiful. We are ready to move trucks in. First truck coming in, four series, which I've just literally jet washed. You're we bringing the four in. series in here. Really? Here. I've got this. This will come in handy. Between that and the uh, blowtorch, I think you're in the right idea. Bought the grinder. We'll try it, actually. Try it, yeah. This looks expensive. Hey. Mm. 
Do you know how to use a grinder, Hannah? No. I'll show you. I don't really know which way these discs work. Do you know how to use a grinder, Tim? That'll do. I'm not sure that'll do is... Mm, that's how you rev them, Helen. So you put it on, and then you go, like a bike. You go, run, 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 run. I'm not sure you do. Oh, I thought I was going to get you then. Safety first. That works a treat! Put that back in here. Put it for one of the Milwaukee products. God, did you win the lottery or something? You didn't tell me. Bad revenue. Gloves? All the gear, no idea, eh? That's what they say, Helen, isn't it? It is what they say, yeah. It is what they say. Every good mechanic needs blue roll. There we go. I made a clock the other day, bored. Made a clock out of a wheel trim. Got these on the wall now. These are the actual badges off the 4 Series. And that number plate, I don't know where we found that. Are you not worried about ruining the floor with the 4 Series? Surely it's going to be absolutely filthy. There's going to be bits of metal flying off it and all sorts. Oh, yeah. oh you, you bought yourself in. a mop. That's where you come in, dear. Hmm. Goes to a short function for you. Lovely. Hmm. Nick from Abka Sporing, who dug off floor, gifted me these. These are seat 10 and 11 from the Royal Box at Wembley Stadium. Well, this is number 10, isn't it? Yeah. That's quite nice. So I'd love to know who has perched upon them. Yeah, but I don't know you know. I'm not sure they go in my office. What a talking point when people walk in. I'll probably just keep on sweeping for the next half hour or so. Ready for the full series, Ellen. So what have you been doing today, Kyle, on the, uh, the mighty FH? Same oh my, boring. making a mess by the looks of things. The same boring thing I've been doing for weeks. I've been chassis prep. You all right there, or...? What are you doing? Labelling so you don't forget where things go. You told me to do that the other day. I'm a bit too late for this. Tank four. Yeah, you see you're a lot more organised than me, Kyle. What are you doing? Well, oh. DAing, mate. Already, the four series parts. Yeah, but which part is it? Pipe. Pipe, pipe, pipe. Smoky, no, watery pipe. Watery pipe. Now we get out of there. Need Look at that. Needle gun. Oh. I think oh. you can put a hole in it now. See that? Oh. Pointless. It's a good start, isn't it? But I've calmed down a bit. Have we? And I've did a little rooting round on here and I've found a part number. Right next to the hole is a part number. So I've been doing some Googling. I found one. Right. £157. Ah, just not a very good start. The not very good start was when you bought it, Tim. I bought something else last night. Uh oh. For the full series. What is it this time? New dials. New dials. Ooh. We do, them. You do need them. Estonia, they're coming from. Jeez. Careful. Oh, jeez. It is heavy. Take this off. Give this a bit of plastic primer. Black plastic paint. Yeah. Until you look the bomb. Mangled. Yeah. Might need a new one of them. Oh. Why is there so many bits? So many bits, why can't they just make it all one piece? They have to have what? five bits to make up one bit. Because it's just scan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no. yeah. Oh. Shoot. Oh. Ah. What we're doing in the upcoming it, episode. It, it might be broken oh, now. Oh no, now I need a new. Mm. Oh. And that's where your fan sits in there. Oh, look. You didn't notice that, did you? No, I didn't until now. New one of them as well. Where's the part number on that? Broke it down here as well, oh, look. No. Just give up, I do. Oh. Yeah, but it's got two screws. Top up, top up. Well, you did. What's the code on this? Flipping hell. 13907. Oh, uh, great. You know what that looks like. There ain't any. So we just bury the whole thing and just go. Can we? Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. That will actually make a lot of people's days. Yeah. Hello. What for today? What's up with you, dear? Just got back from Sean's 
Yeah. Couldn't have a look at the full series with Kyle. There was a piece in the cab, and I thought, I'll clean that up and see how that comes up on closer inspection at all in it. But I have, which is going to prove... Invaluable. There we go, that word. Invaluable when it comes to this 4 Series build. This piece of software here, Helen. Look, There's the, a picture of a yellow lorry. It's the 4 Series. Did you do yours yellow? No, call-in system. Press radiator, but look, you click it, everything here look, even shows you, you can zoom in, shows you how everything goes together. Uh, it's like a Lego kit. It is basically an instruction manual. So go to fan, look. This is the piece I need. Every component, look, even down to nuts and bolts. Auxiliary heater, engine cab heater socket. That's how you build it. Look, uh, and that's, that's how you, you build it. And these all the individual, say you've got it and I go, oh, I'm missing that bit. Press 18, highlights are here, gives you the part number. And then you just order it from Scania. And then you order it from Scania and pay lots of money for it. Click on frame. This is chassis. Look, <laughs> yeah, look. It's like Airfix model instructions for an actual 4 Series. I'm going to be here many of hours making notes. Your dog really look, likes it too, yeah. look. Silly dog. I'm very excited to get started on this 4 Series. Bank account, on the other hand, is not so excited. Even door. Let's press door. Oh, a door! There's your door and the different parts you need to make your door up. But what if your actual Down door's this... broken? Does it tell you how to buy a new door? Well, it gives you a part number for the door. Look, number one is your door. Oh, it's like the actual door frame. shell 1384421. Clever. Doesn't tell you your price though. No. Wonder why. Mm. Luckily, my doors are okay. Number nine, you see these little caps? I am actually missing one of these, and they apparently are like gold dust. Aye. Now, in this yellow curtain cider is the rest of my four series. Here are some bits. Let's climb in and have a little look because there is something we are going to need very soon. So we're going to need these, these spring leaves. So I've currently got three leaf springs each side and these are two leaf springs each side which are going to bring the truck down a little bit so it's not sitting right up in the air. They've got to go to the units, so we've got to put them on. I'm going to need to change all the bushes in here as well. New spring eye bushes. These are my steps and things. Here are the massive tanks that are on it. There's this one and that one over there. That was mine. I'm going to need a lot of bits. I've really got to have a good sort through this. Me and my knock stack up there. Mm, these are all my plastics. You know, they've got to be replaced. Really no good. The truck and timber sticker on the grill there. I remember putting that on when I got it. More of my cab walk. Another plate, look. K12 SJN in the front bumper. So we take that to the unit. Now these are the hinges for the grill. That can be cleaned up, that bracket. Rubbed down and painted. Might need that bracket to see that back as well. That'll be a job for another day. Come down here, empty this trailer, go through it and strip down any bits that are good that can be reused, refurbished, repainted, and all the other stuff can in the bin. Get these springs in the Ranger. They are heavy. This is gonna make the four series sit about that much lower. Wow. Jeez. Two, two leaf springs. Loaded in the back of the Ranger. Wow, they were heavy. That's it. I'm moving out, Darren. Pack your bags. Pack your bags. That's moving it. Moving out. Ooh. We need frame making as well. A trestle for my cab, because I want to bring that here. You've not seen the back of me yet. Okay. We'll put one of these wheel stillages up. When can we do that? When's the show season finished? Uh, a couple of weeks after Newark. It's like you're 16, 17, just moving out. <laughs> you'll, the amount of stuff you've got, you'll be renting next door. Storm over there, look. Yeah, it's coming, isn't it? That's shifting, though. Look how them clouds are moving. Thunder. Let's put me well as on. The thunder cut. <laughs> the first parts of the 4 Series are coming into the unit. So this is the windscreen wiper bracket thing. That's where the windscreen motor goes. New battery tray for the 4 Series. I've had this ages. It's like one of the first things I bought for it. It's actually 
I don't think you can hear that, chucking it down the rain outside. But this is the beauty of the unit. We can have the trucks in here, working in the dry and out there, chucking it down. It'll be so good for the winter, this unit. So good. In here now, we've got all the merchandise set out. There's a link in the description to the merch store. And this is where your order will be packed from now on. I've got this lovely little area here. So we've moved all that from there and put the water rack in there. And I've got some my model trucks are down here now. A couple of trucker tin trucks up there. So now the next job is to wheel in the four series. That's going to go there. And then the R series will sit here. Lots of other trucks coming in and out of here as well. I think Kyle wants to bring his down, do a bit of work in the winter time. My cousin wants to come down and give his a really good detail and valet. So yeah, you'll be able to see those as well. We'll get visitors in and yeah, it's gonna be an absolutely awesome place to be. It's time. Oh, oh, Let's get the four series on. Let's go. Ah! Oscar in an IV coat. How's the IV coat? Oh, beautiful. Look at it. Is that your steering? It is going for you. Yep, all good, driver. Drop. Yep. Oh! <laughs> That'll do, Pete. Yeah, we're on. That'll do. She's on the deck. Yep. Your steering wheel's up there. Mole grips. The mold grips. Moly hole grips. That's going to be fun taking off at the other end, isn't it? It is, mate. Look at all this oil and stuff that's going to be on my unit floor. Um, this is what happens. Look! Oh. <laughs> I thought, you, thought you wanted a workshop, not a doctor's surgery. <laughs> oh yeah, look, it's drip, 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 It's all on drip. the wing tops. I'd put some granules on that before we go anywhere. Oh, oh Sean! Oh dear. You didn't even get it on the oil. <laughs> you can just put it about a bit. Nothing good comes from YouTube, only the Trucker Tim channel. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Alright. Are you vaping, Tim? Oh, well, I didn't want to be, but it looks like I am. What's this man? Well, come on then, let's see him. Where is he? Where's the police? Jeez. Got pulled over again. Again? That's off the Oh. <laughs> I've lost him, Sean, with his oh. strap. God. Hurry up, because we've got to go and do another load from Biggles Wage yet. Yeah? What? Yeah, come on, hurry oh, really? up. Yes. Hmm. When did you say? Oh, here he is. Look, round like that, through there, like that. Pull that, roll, look, boom. Mm. That's easy. He went like that, <laughs> round there, yeah. through there. Yeah. And then he went like He weren't tight enough to start. Hang on. Oh, look. Shut it. Not quite, mate. It's close, better than you had. It comes down, it goes under your wheel. Rips the lorry off. Yeah. Rips all his wings off. Yeah. And twist. Keep twisting. <laughs> <laughs> I think for now we'll just leave it. Just leave it swinging. I'm That'll not be a good right. man. Like yeah. a candle in the wind. Don't get me going again. It seems to me you lived your life like a candle in the wind. Is that your hammer? Where did that arrive from? Huh? Where's the hammer Oh, right let's from? go! Yeah, <laughs> yeah let's see if I'm going to be swerving yeah. the question. Am I clean? Yeah. <laughs> Too late. I'm in. Ready? <clears throat> the next step. Go! Here she comes. I wonder how long it's going to be parked here for, Kyle. Oh. I've got to get it in position, though, sure. What way are we putting it in? Frontwards or backwards? Backwards. We've got the truck spotter here. He loves Where me. Where is he? He always gets me on. Where? I'm going to give him a load. They're going to give him loads there of time. There he is, look. There he is. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> he love it, doesn't he? Look at this IV go with Look the ball bar on. Yeah! 570 that is. Here he comes! No! 
Oh, baby! <laughs> So let's get her off, shorty boy. Are you steering? Uh, what with the mole grips? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I don't really want that brake chamber dragging on me floor. Well, so it's, it's a workshop. No, it's a workshop, but I want to try and keep it nice. Oh god. I've got to steer it. Welcome to your new home for series. This has turned into a proper restoration job. Oh yeah. The four series is coming into the unit. Finally. I really don't want to scratch this floor. And she comes. She's in drive. She's in. Ah, she's been well christened now. Oh, lovely. There's a bit of oil in here. It's nice, isn't it? Feels nice. Good on you. Yeah, do you like it? First time you've seen it. It is since you've had this bit done. Yeah, it's start work now. I've got all my tools. Bought something new. What you bought new? Ah. What are you gonna do with that? Set it on fire. Tight nuts. Tight nuts. Yeah. What's the first job then, Tim? First thing I'll do, use my 20 ton jack. Where's your 20 ton jack? Here. I'll use that. That looks, oh, Halford special. Yeah, that'll jack her up, boy. Two ton. Yep, that'll jack her up. Uh, oh. Get the wheels off, get it on the axle stands. The axle stands. Went up a notch from Halfords, went, went Seely. Oh, they look like um, they made of chocolate. That'll be all right. Leave this with me. When I come back next time, it'll be ready. Once you've rebuilt the engine, yeah, yeah, you'll be able. We'll put that on the king, and put it in here with the teleport. We can drop it straight in there. Drop it straight in there, and then I'll reconnect it all. I'm gonna put gearbox in. Yeah, and that as well. We put the clutch in it, can't we, and everything before it comes here. Do that down yours. And put gearbox in. Yeah. So there we go guys, the 4 Series is in the unit. I really cannot believe the 4 Series is in my own workshop. It's just awesome. What a journey this has been so far and we've got plenty more to come. I cannot wait to get stuck into this. Now it's in here, we've got a lovely space to work on it. We can crack on. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, guys. And also, if you want to follow the full restoration of my 4 Series, hit that subscribe button.